Hello, good morning. Good morning, sir. What's your full name? My first name is Sikha and my family name is Singh. You can call me with my first name, please. All right, Sikha. Would you tell me about your job or studies? What do you do? Well, I am a full-time bachelor student. I have uh, take admission in a bachelor level uh, as a, a BBS course. Can you tell me what do you like to do in your leisure time? Well, I prefer going to nature and I like to spend the time uh, with the environment and I feel so relaxed by spending time in the environment. Let's begin from part one and the topic is related to flowers. Do you have a favorite flowers or plants? Why or why not? Yes, flowers gives me a lot of pleasure, especially the bright colored ones. Uh, I am... Uh, I am really keen on the uh, colorful flowers and sunflowers are definitely my favorite ones because it gives me uh, a symbolic meaning and uh, it also represents the um, flexibility to overcome the obstacles uh, happiness and good luck right okay what kinds of flowers and plants grow near where you live why or why not uh, yes, uh, people plant many uh, trees uh, in my hometown. Uh, most, uh, one of the most uh, popular trees which uh, people plant is uh, neem tree and ba banya trees uh, as it has uh, a significant uh, signs that uh, they, are, uh, they have the qualities to purify the air and have the medical cures. And um, on the other hand, uh, uh, some people like to plant uh, fruit also, um, like uh, mango and banana trees uh, as well. And it is also trendy and frequently uh, planted. And students love to uh, plant the sunflower, rose and marigold. Is it important to you to have flowers and plants in your home? Why or why not? Well, uh, yes, I do like to have flowers in my home as it helps the elegant uh, beauty and uh, naturally beautiful with a lovely scent. And it also helps me to overcome my stre stress. And um, besides that, the, uh, the flowers come in va various uh, shapes, size and color, which also uh, helps to make my home uh, interior better than better than before and most of the time uh, it also provides me the natural uh, beauty okay have you ever bought flowers for someone else why or why not uh, yes i do remember i brought uh, a flower uh, a few days ago uh, i brought a bouquet of a rose uh, to gift uh, my parents in their anniversary and uh, knowing that they love uh, the rose flower and they never overjoyed when they get it mm, all right okay we have completed part one and now let's move to part two it is a q card session round i'll hand over questions paper and pen you'll get a minute preparation time and after that you have to speak one to two minutes and you can see questions okay and paper and pen okay but don't write a question paper your preparation time begins now Okay, all right. Your preparation time is over. Please start speaking. Uh, well, uh, uh, product review is nowadays very trendy on the internet. People like to share their experience about the product which they have already used and share with the world. And um, online review uh, also provides the information to the people whether the product is uh, reliable or not. They also explain, they also share the um, experience of uh, the product services and how the product uh, gave the outcome after, uh, beyond their expectation. And online uh, review also helps to develop the um, public awareness. Uh, also, and uh, I am really uh, not I am I'm really not rely on. Uh, yeah, continue. I'm really uh, not really on uh, talking about the reviews over online, but uh, uh, I 
my friend instituted me to uh, overview the review before buying the product which i wanted to buy and uh, i also think that uh, I should look over the review before buying the computer. Of course, computer is uh, made of one of the most reliable and prestigious brands or companies. But uh, I also think that I should go through the review online. So I think of going to some uh, famous product uh, companies uh, comparison website uh, in my country and uh, by looking the review i was shocked because the review were negative and uh, it was not the review which i have expected uh, so i went uh, shocked and uh, i think that uh, the review is given by some mad uh, uh, customers also but beside that i think with my critical mind and know that the review or the negative re review with the customer has left was not the uh, was the knowledgeable person who have uh, commented or given their views uh, based on the facts and provided many details about the product so i decided uh, to not to not to buy about any computer uh, from the so called brands or prestigious brand so i wanted i went through many resources and uh, gather many knowledge so that i can find the best product which i wanted so i decided to not to not to go through the very prestigious uh, brand so i decided to uh, take the specialist uh, review for buying the product so i think the decision that i had taken to uh, see the review online was uh, good for me as i know that i i know i knew that the uh, big brands or uh, prestigious brands computers are not so much reliable and uh, they also have many defects so i should uh, talk to my specialist to before buying any products Okay, all right. Thank you very much. We have completed part two. Now let's move to part three. Please hand over these questions, paper and pen. Okay, all right. Thank you very much. And in part three, questions are related to online reviews. And first question goes likewise. What kinds of things do people write online reviews about in your country? Well, it's a tough question. Let me think about it. Um, I believe uh, that uh, that. Uh, it is very popular being service oriented industries like hotels restaurant uh, restaurants uh, tourism and transportation in my country as uh, beside this uh, industries have online uh, presence in my country on the other hand in many part of other uh, countries in the world most of the people love to give review about uh, the furniture uh, clothing or home appliance and uh, electronic appliance which they have brought from the online okay and why do some people write online reviews well i think uh, people uh, people uh, write online review as they have made the, it uh, their habit or uh, it can also be said that uh, People offer uh, online review because they are frustrated uh, by using certain products and services or they are being really excited to use uh, the product which they have brought. And also, beside this, uh, on the, uh, beside this, online review helps to develop the public awareness uh, at the end of the day. I have told you before also okay and do you think that online reviews are good for both shoppers and companies yes i do believe that online reviews are positive and good for both the customers and uh, uh, companies as uh, the online review provides uh, the customers to know about the noticed and lead for their uh, sales and no no and the cost and the companies also 
get to know about the customer dissatisfaction about their products or services which they can improve by uh, looking after their uh, reviews and also they can improve uh, the trusting uh, relationship between the customers and uh, companies um, and uh, the online review also helps to reassurance uh, about the uh, purchasing uh, purchasing decision by the to the customers and also helps to build online platform for uh, doing online shopping okay why do you think it might be like to work in a customer service job well i think uh, customer service job is uh, a very resourceful uh, problem solver patient listener as uh, and um, and uh, i also think that uh, the the job can be both uh, challenging and rewarding as uh, if we get the customer who didn't uh, complain about the product and services then it can be a rewarding job for us but on the other hand we can uh, if we are dealing with the rude customer uh, which we cannot handle in a critical situation then it can be challenging also do you agree that customers are more likely to come there nowadays uh, yes, I do believe that customers are more uh, customer indeed are more uh, likely to complain nowadays because uh, if they didn't get the uh, product and services uh, according to their expectation, uh, and uh, the second reason can be if uh, they didn't uh, get the uh, services uh, customer service uh, route by the uh, companies and uh, last but not the least i think nowadays uh, the customers are being more aware about the rights that the customers uh, can do complain because they have paid for it how important is it for companies to take all customer complaints seriously yes i do believe that uh, companies should uh, take uh, the co customers complaint uh, seriously and in a valid reason because uh, the if the customer complain then the companies can lose their reputation and by knowing the customer dissatisfaction the co companies should not ignore it as uh, the complaint provides the companies to uh, make better by preventing the problem which uh, the, their customer are facing if they want to stay in the competition they should uh, be aware about the customer dissatisfaction all right okay thank you very much we have completed today's speaking session now it's feedback session time if we see first part that is fluency okay you were fluent and to get high score again you need to work out on fluency as we can see mm, or in your sentences so you have to work on that fluency part okay next one is pronunciation the words you are pronouncing were almost all correct whereas if we observe grammar then you are using various forms in grammar also it's totally fine and if we talk about vocabularies you are using much more better vocabularies than previous time and if I have to provide you a score, then I would give you 6.5 out of 9. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir.